everyone, Danny Atkinson here. I hope that you're all having a good day. Um, my day today is much getting much better um, because my keyboard is now back in action. And I think that some of you thought I was talking about um, the keyboard of my computer. And I thank you so much for giving me um, instruction and tips on how to um, get it working again and how to clean it out and everything. I was actually talking about my um, piano keyboard and um, some of you knew that but I basically you know the coffee spilled I cleaned it off of the surface and um, you know I thought that I had gotten it all out I was really trying to be detailed about it I turned the keyboard on it was working in spots where the coffee hadn't spilled but the keys that the coffee had spilled on were not working and then I said, okay, maybe there's still coffee that dripped inside. So I flipped it over and I was letting that coffee spill out. A lot of coffee was spilling out. And then when I tried to turn it on after that, um, for a while it just wouldn't even turn on. So then I just kind of left it. I said, you know, right now I was very upset. Um, and then uh, now it's fully functioning again. Thank goodness. Um, you know, but when I was going through that and I was, you know, really upset, I kind of, you know, just let things um, get to me and just one thing after another was just sort of upsetting me. Um, recently, you know, I, I called my sister and she really helped me put things in perspective and she just, you know, she said to me, you cannot get upset over the small stuff. And, you know, I always know that. Um, and, you know, I don't usually get myself worked up over things that, you know, little mishaps like this. But I just, it was like so overwhelming, probably because, you know, everything that I have going on, I'm just so busy all the time. And it was just like another thing added to the list of, oh my gosh, now I have to worry about this. Or now I don't have this and I have to get a new one. And just like the hassle and the headache of it when I, you know, want to use it to be rehearsing and writing and all of that so um that was just super upsetting but thing and the other thing that really helped me in that moment was just pushing through pushing forward and still continuing to just dive into music um you know i listened to angelina jordan's song uh that was the first one that i listened to after and it just you know it it helped me to just kind of like keep going and to just remember that you know to relax me um, because music is just, it has that effect on you. But thankfully it has all worked out and I wanted to say thank you to all of you who, you know, came to the rescue in my comments and tried to either cheer me up or give me pointers on how to correct it and point me in the right direction on that. So, um, thankfully it is all up and running now and we're good. Um, I will be sure not to bring any liquids anywhere near the keyboard anymore um, because I just don't want to go through anything like that again. So my coffee is nowhere around. I can promise you that. Um, and aside from that, I am working on the gold video and I'm really excited because I can't wait for you guys to hear this song. Um, gold is an original song and it's one that is so close to my heart and it means a lot to me. Um, I'm thinking of doing sort of a three-part series leading up to gold um, where I give you guys you know an inside look into the writing process of gold. I'll talk to you guys about exactly how I wrote the song, what the song means, um, you know the inspiration behind it and all of that and um, what I hope that you get from gold because um, it's not just about me. It's about delivering a message to my fans and giving you guys something that will help you through. Um, you know, we've created this awesome community here and it is my, my want and my dream and my purpose to always give back to you guys, to always, you know, um, offer you something. So whether it's advice or just an escape or, um, you know, determination, inspiration, just something. So whatever your takeaway is, if you take something away from it, then I feel that my job has been done. Um, and you know, I really am hoping to do that with my original music. It's been 
a while since I've released an original song so this will be the first one in a long time and uh, that comes with a lot of nerves and anxiety and high hopes and um, so I will be you know hoping that it gets a good reaction and that you all really enjoy it. I think it has a powerful message and um, I think it's something that a lot of people will relate to so I'm hoping that that comes through to you all and that you all do enjoy it um, as much as I enjoyed writing it and recording it um, and I'll give you guys all the details in that three-part series so I think that would be a lot of fun uh, you guys can get an inside scoop into me as an artist and a better understanding of you know my my writing inspiration and my writing process because it's different for every artist and it's also different on every album, it's different on every song so I think it'll be cool for you guys to to know that before the song comes out and you know I want it to have that sort of build up for you so that you guys can really understand where I'm coming from and, and uh, get to know me a little bit better as an artist as well so for you guys I'm off this week from school so uh, that's you know fun and exciting so I'll do a live stream this week so uh, I will definitely jump on here maybe a couple times just to do short lives and, and hang out with you all um, and uh, because you know I love connecting with you like that and don't forget to keep your requests coming because even if I can't always answer all the comments I am scrolling through and reading them and I I'm taking into account which songs are more popularly requested so the more that you comment and request it the more likely I am to get to it it does get difficult to respond to everything but just know that I'm always aware of your comments and I love them I appreciate them so much and I do my best to hop in and respond as much as I possibly Once again, I just wanted to jump on, give you guys a little update because you guys were so sweet and so caring and so concerned about how to fix my keyboard. I was referring to my piano keyboard, not the computer keyboard. Um, so that's why I was even more upset because, you know, it's obviously a bigger item to replace and uh, luckily it all worked out. It's working fine. Um, so thank you for those well wishes, those tips, those pointers, and we have a lot to look forward to together. I have a lot of things that I'm working on. My mind is always brewing with new ideas and new ways to connect with you all. So I've got a nice week of reactions coming up and some live streams and original music. So I'm really excited and I love you all very much. As always, I'm so thankful for you. And if you want to also join me over on my social platforms like Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook, you can be sure to do that too. It's at Danny Atkinson across the board. I love you all so, 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 so much. And I'll see you this week.